Buy Sigma. Marienburg was a city of the Empire, but in 2429, the city's Burgomeisters colluded with Emperor Dieter IV to secure their independence in return for a massive donation of gold to the Imperial coffers. When the scandalous affair came to light, Dieter was quickly deposed and Wilhelm III of Altdorf became the new Emperor. Numerous attempts over the past decades to restore Marienburg to the Empire had all failed, and the city remained so fiercely independent that Theoderic Gosser of Nordland, nominally the ruler of Marienburg, was forbidden to return under pain of an excruciatingly hideous death. Now, at last, Marienburg is under imperial rule once more, and Theoderic is merely a bloody footnote in Marienburg's history. Such is the fate of all traitors who turn against their emperor. You, we can appoint an elector count. Aldebrand Ludenhof. Could do that. Do I want that? You know what? No. Gotrek Gurnison. You are the mightiest slayer the Empire has ever seen, and as a reward for your service, the Emperor will appoint a dwarf to be the elector count. Marienburg. It's a bit ridiculous, but who cares? Key to the Staatsrat. Symbolically, the Stadtholder holds both the key to Marienburg's parliament buildings and, not so symbolically, the real levers of power in the province. Okay. Even though income from ports 15%. That's pretty awesome. You know what? Errol Ziegler. Yeah, I changed my mind. Errol Ziegler will become uh, the Elector Count simply because this bonus. This item is ridiculously powerful in Marienburg in order for us to get more money. So, where's Adolf Ziegler? You? Yes, key to the Staatsrad. Hello there. And. Can they reach us in one round? Oh, yes, they can, that's bad. Oh, uh, let's hope they won't attack us. Okay, so that's a problem. So let's give him a couple Swords of Ulrich. Swords of Ulrich! Oh, we haven't gotten that yet. Uh, one of the many regiments formed and paid for by the Temple of Ulrich in Middenheim. The formidable training of the Swords of Ulrich consists not of marches or weapons practice, but instead of patrols and war parties led out of the city into the surrounding Drakwald. Initiates hoping to join the unit must accompany such excursions. Only those that fight with honor and survive are admitted. It is left to each soldier to equip himself in the blue and white colors of Middenheim. Since the regiment's founding, in the days when Count Manderet rallied the Empire behind him and became Emperor, the sons of Ulrich have borne yellow shields to battle. By tradition, each shield bears a variation of the same device, a red wolf signifying Ulrich embattled. The grim northerners have little room for formal ceremony, but what they lack in parade, ground discipline, they make up for with savagery on the battlefield. Interesting. Uh, it doesn't really help us right now. I don't want to invest too much into him. Oh, we can go there. Oh, everything's fine. Never mind. We can reach the town without issue. Okay, Marineburg is safe. Everything's fine. Never mind. That was totally unnecessary. I'm going to leave them there regardless. It doesn't really hurt. Isle Heart, okay. Grunbur, I don't need that. That's not useful. So we're going to save to upgrade Altdorf to a city state. Level 5. Oh, they're still here again. Oh, that's bugger. Yeah, you go bother Bellacor again. What? Oh, critical failure! Ah, oh, wounded! Yeah. Oh dear. How about diplomacy? No, 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 no. Nope. Nope. Nobody's willing to 
get into diplomatic actions with the Empire. Helmgard, yes, finally. Oh, we're even getting a Hellstorm rocket battery. Ooh. Well, now we're talking. Now we're going to be cut. Wait, what? Why are we at war with the elves? What? When did that happen? I thought they just ended their non-aggressive pact with us. Why are we at war with them suddenly? Uh, that's like, that's terrible. Um, okay. That's seriously, that's terrible. Why are we at war with the Wood Elves? What, what's the problem of these pointy-eared buggers? I mean, Gimli was right. Ugh, goodness. Never trust an elf. I mean, what? Why are we constantly at war with them? I'm not doing anything. I'm not attacking them. I'm not even trespassing in their region. I'm just trying to peacefully coexist with them. But the elves are constantly striving to attack us. I mean, why? I mean, first the Bretonians attack them, then the dwarves attack them, and now they attack us? I mean, I'm not doing anything. I'm just trying to exist. I'm trying to have a peaceful journey in the Empire. I'm trying to unite everyone. I'm trying to destroy the forces of darkness in order for the forces of good to survive, but apparently that's not wanted. That's not what they want. They want obliteration. They want to... They want the old world to succumb to darkness. To the, to the creatures of the demonic invasions. I mean, what? Guys, can we please join together and work together in order to survive against the coming onslaught? That would be nice. That would be beautiful. Please. Let's see how all of this goes. Anything great to be uh, current four. That's bad. Supervisor. Uh, defeated Throt the Unclean. Oh, that was Throt the Unclean. Ten percent health. Never mind. Nice. Ella loses outpost. Begins construction. Okay, we can't reach that in one round. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That's a lot of enemies. Uh, we're going to obliterate them. Why do we only have one skill point? Hmm. Why is nobody willing to, to fight us? And we're going to destroy all of them. Of course we will. Treasury, yes. Done. Kill Buck. Buck. Done. We don't really need unit experience, so we're just going to ransom the captives to get money. He won't die as well. Good. Spell resistance. We're going to execute captives later on to get a bonus. Uh, melee defense. Perfect. The Empire. Yeah, let's just replenish here. Can they reach the city in one round? No, they can't. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm pre I'm clicking, if you're new to a total war, I'm clicking on the enemy army, and then I can see their potential range of motion. Now, this is probably not forced march, but that's not a problem, since in forced march they cannot attack someone or settlement. So this is um, the range that they have in one round, so we're fine. They can't attack this in one round. Okay, Cloudy, uh, how about you scavenge block army? Try to get... You know what? No. Uh, let's see what these ruins hold. Yeah, that was obvious. So there's no army inside there. That's that's a valuable information. Florian. Okay, Marienburg's kind of fine. Okay, Bellaco is fleeing. That's great. So we can, yeah, we will have to deal with the elves, down buggers. I don't want to fight them, but 
They're so keen on fighting us. Uh, so now I have no choice. I'm going to disband our warband so we can get another one. And yeah. I'm going to get rid of Sigmar's sons. Knights of the Black Rose. Whoa. Whoa. Well, would you? Whoa. <laughs> Templars of Sigma. <laughs> Unit of renown. So they are the absolute beasts. Okay, so now we have... Oh my goodness. Warhammer armored troops. With warhammers. <laughs> Look at what a community created for us. <laughs> oh my goodness. Imperial halberdiers. So halberdiers on steroids. Nice. Uh, warrior saints. So they are apparently extremely powerful. Like Jesus, are they powerful? But they are two turn recruit warrior saints of Tal. Whoa. <laughs> oh, oh Jager Corpse. Oh, we can recruit them in one round. Uh, okay. Archers, it is time for you to go. So first I'm going to recruit one strong melee unit. Uh, Imperial Guardsman. Melee attack, fire damage. Out of Company of Honor. I'm kind of tempted to go for Out of Company of Honor. Simply because uh, I, I want them. And we're going to. Even though we also need artillery. Yeah, we definitely need artillery. So goodbye Mortars. And we're going to replace you with the Hellstorm Rocket Battery, Great Cannon. Now it becomes difficult. What are we going to do? Um, hmm. I only want to spend... Whoa, Warrior Priests of Sigmar. <laughs> Look at them. Hammers of Sigmar. What's the difference? Armor piercing, armor shielded, charge defense against all. They have a shield. Both look awesome. Knights of the Black Rose. Damn, would you look at this recruitment chap? Okay, so I want one Jaeger Corpse Long Rifles. That was the original plan. Hochland Long Rifles. Ooh. Damn. Okay, what is the Iron Sights? Bayonet Rifle. Ooh. Decent melee combatants, and they have a melee weapon, so that's great. What else do we have here that could interest us? Knight's Panther. Oh, now we're talking. Knight of the Hammers of Sigmar. Ooh, Reich's got Griffin Knights. Griffins, flying cavalry. We can, we can recruit flying units. Imperial Lead Belchers. Darn. Bombard. What? Uh, so basically a cannon on steroids, a bit less ammunition in range, but much more damage, and a lot faster. Ooh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have so much fun with this campaign. Okay. Um, yeah, let's improve Karabu. That's fine. He's still, uh, you bugger. Go away, please. I'm tempted to upgrade this just to have a stronger garrison against all of them. Wolf heart. Oh, that's a problem. Oh, I didn't even notice. The mod that I got for us that gives us a stronger garrison. Apparently, it doesn't work on level 4 settlements. So if we want a stronger garrison, we actually have to. Help, dears. Yeah, we have to let it stay at level 3, which I don't mind. Okay, that's definitely stronger. Um, Karl Franz, he's done. Ah, okay, let's see. You, okay, we still can't upgrade that yet. That's not a problem. Spread control, damage walls, whatever. Salt the garrison, and now Gotrek, Count Vlad von Karstein. Are stronger our allies severely weakened um, I'm not sure if that's a wise idea attacking him 
We could take Castle Temple off. Yeah, why not? He's giving us the opportunity to do so, so we're going to take his mighty castle, which is not mighty at all, oddly enough. Castle Templehof, yeah. Uh, okay. What is Todbringer? Yeah, you're still going strong. What's to do here? Yes. Yeah, recruiting, that's totally fine. People's archer, oh, almost 200 range. Nice. Yeah, the Bretonians are fighting the Wood Elves again. I don't know what their problem is. And I want to befriend the Wood Elves, since we have an end time event where the Wood Elves will suddenly make wild hunt with, I don't know, 100 full stacks against the entire world. But apparently in this game, this is not something that we can achieve. So we will have to prepare at least 10 full stacks to deal with the Wood Elves in round, what, 200 something? So this will not be easy. Greetings from Sigma. Ah, Marienburg, city port of merchants. At the mouth of the river Reich stands Marienburg, one of the largest, richest, most corrupt and dangerous city ports in the old world. It is a den of pirates, assassins and black marketeers. Here everything is for sale and nothing is without a price. Marienburg is also known as the city of gold, which alone conveys a good idea of the wealth of this sprawling city. Nowhere else can exotic goods from as far away as the elven kingdoms of Ulthuan, a distant cafe, be found so readily. Ah, Belakor has returned. Are oh, you bugger? And we need to be able to defend Marienburg. Hmm. Uh, yeah, so let's get a couple of units. I don't really want to, but we need to be able to defend this. And we need to deal with the elves in the south. How far can they go in one round? Okay, so he he does have a full stack in Bretonia. So I'm kind of tempted to help him. Do they need help against the wood elves? Not really. So why not? Let's help the Bretonians against Belakor. Okay, I'll hunt. Everything's going fine here. Once. I see no other option. Yeah, I'll just destroy the town. Obliterate everyone. Well done. And occupy. Good. Very good. Number success chance. Whatever. Okay, dokie. Carl Franz. You want... You know what? Let's improve the Pegasus. Why not? Let's just improve everything. So we're fine here. They will be judged. Let's see what's in Kislev. 
Another fourth stack. I was afraid of that. Always dangerous with the Skaven, they can oh, to the exclusion of all else. When a witch hunter sides their quarry, they command all nearby allies to concentrate fire upon them. Affects allies in range. Accuracy missile whoa, whoa, da, 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 da. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. But not what we need right now. Okay, Felix. Oh, we could even reach them in one Oh, we can take Castle Darkenhof. Yes. Done. Nice. They don't protect it. That was no. Oh, <laughs> uh, suddenly. Oh, Gold Smelter. 1400 income. Hero recruit rank for Empire Captains all provinces. Up. Ooh, da, 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 da. That's, that's very good. This also reduces time of Reichland. Global recruitment capacity, yes. Yeah, so we're going to keep this one. What else are we going to build here? We do have that. Skaven, I don't really care about. Definitely going for more money. Uh, control. Yeah, and growth. That is great. The cleansing of Sylvania. Long ago, the inept Count Otto von Drack fell victim to the machinations of Vlad von Karstein, who became the first vampire Count of Sylvania. Vlad married the Count's daughter Isabella, and together they brought darkness and misery to the lands of Sylvania, which seceded from the Empire shortly thereafter. Now, after centuries of vampiric rule, the sun shines on Sylvania once again. After a lengthy siege, the cursed citadel, Castle Drakenhof, was stormed by force by the Emperor's finest. The vampires within were set alight or staked through the heart. Yet, despite the great victory, Sylvania is still a broken land. Warpstone, shattered starts litter the landscape. And in many places, the dead still walk amongst the living. Though the Grand Theogenist has dispatched scores of zealous flagellants and witch hunters, it will take many years to purge these blighted lands, but it will be done. Nice. Alright. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, pure beard minus corruption is kind of important right now. What else do we have here? Mighty Forge, Blade Master. So we we're done here, right? We have everything. Yeah, so we can do nothing anymore. It's a bit odd that um, Felix has the martial mastery skill done, but Gottfried hasn't. Hmm. Fourteen. Okay. Assassinate. We're done here. Yeah, assassination. And you are going for assaulting units and martial prowess. Perfect. So we have Castle Drakenhof now. And Errol Siegler. I would like you to become proper army. We need it. There's not much choice here. Let's go for that. No, what? Why not? Give a bit of cavalry. Give him a bit of sigma. So even though they're, they're, they're not worth the upkeep. I mean, 400 upkeep is also very steep. Yeah, it's probably not really worth it. Of so, mm, go to Eilhard. And recruit units with a better... to performance ratio okay what are we going to get here let 500 thrice pistols missile strength 180 holy schmoly reich's got griffin knights kind of awesome we also have empire pegasus knights and imperial griffin brothers Imperial Wyvern Knight Warden Knights uh -huh. uh, Knights of the Vengeful Sun 
Ooh. So very powerful. Uh, but not what I need right now. I would like to... Ooh. Reich's got handguns. Okay. Bugschutzen. Iron sights. Again. 200, 190. Line breakers. Gun Great X Infantry. Mega Corps. Hochland Long Rifle. Bombard. Okay. Uh, Hochland Long Rifle. Okay, they are definitely the better unit. But they also only have 4,000 health, so that's a bit of a problem. So let's go with the Hochland Long Rifle. And Sennets. Habuk Schutzen. How do the Reichs got. Okay, so more range, less missile strength. So it's okay. Now we're just going for a bit of infantry. I would like... What is cheap and valuable? 140, 130. Out of Company of Honor, surprisingly, is relatively inexpensive. Imperial Guardsman. The Company of Honor is very strong. So we're going with an Altdorf Company of Honor. After all, they're going to defend Marineborg. And of course, since there's so much... Uh, I mean, there's a heck lot of scum, as we just read about in Marineborg. So we're going to have Warrior Priests of Sigmar with us. Okay, so this will be the defense force of Marineborg. 15, that will be more than enough. Equipment check. It's fine. Fine. Do we have anything diplomatic to happen here? No, 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 no. Okay, now we're just going to end the round. I mean, it's not looking terrible right now, but it's also not looking particularly great. Speak, I will hear you now. Be warned, my mood is dark. Avaland. Yeah, of course we're going to accept the refugees. Great debate. Two! Whoa, what? Um, yes. Oh, faction destroyed Avaland. <laughs> uh, ally. Ambusher. Oh, they're trying to ambush us. Um, where, where's, where's Flood? Ambusher. Oh, there you are. Well, that I, I don't really care about that. Baldur the Chatres, Middenheim, ah, you know what, that is a story for the next episode.